The Olympic Games were launched in the 8th century before Christ. Apart from heat, humidity, contaminated water and insects, they ran the risk of injuries that demanded first aid and immediate medical attention. Needless to say, boxing and wrestling injuries were not casual but deliberate. Each athlete tried to gain victory by injuring his opponent, thus obliging him to concede. In the Pancration, the risk was even greater, as this was the roughest of contests. A combination of body-to-body -body fighting and boxing where any kind of blow was permitted. Pancration athletes risked their lives to win their olive branches. They all, without exception, needed medical treatment after the contest. Unfortunately, we do not have much medical evidence or testimony. But according to the mythology records, the first medicine man, Shaman, was Orpheus, the legendary musician who was sent by the gods to protect humans from diseases. The most famous of these was certainly Hippocrates, the great physician who exercised a permanent influence on the development of medicine and the evolution of doctor's ethics. The Hippocratic Oath is perhaps the greatest gift of Hippocrates to humanity. Contains the promise by the physician to safeguard the highest human and professional duties by leading a simple and honorable life and by practicing medicine honorably. Hippocrates was present during the ancient Olympics, not only in the sense that there should be need for physicians, but also because of the broader philosophical ideals he represented. And it is certainly to be hoped that Hippocrates' wisdom will continue to be present today in all the modern Olympiads.